Dirty Honey. And I'm going to do a little lesson on one of our new riffs that's coming out on our up and coming album, which will be released in 2021. And it's going to be from a song called Gypsy. It's the riff I just played. So without further ado, let's get into it. I'm going to try to be as fast as I can. First off, I tune to E flat. Dirty Honey's always in E flat. I'm in E flat right now. So if you want to play along, tune to E flat. But I'm going to talk in terms of E because it's just easier to say that way. So right off the bat, we have the standard E chord. Not reinventing the wheel here, just start with the chord you probably first learn. The way we're going to strum it is open E string, and then we're going to do an up stroke on the E and the B. And then I'm going to do a quick mute. So real fast, it's like... That's the first notes of the song. Okay, then we get into the next run, the line, and it's basically all E minor. And it's going to be on the E string, it's frets 2 and 3, F sharp and G. Okay, and then on the next string, it's frets 2 and 4. Then back to the E string for fret 3 and 0. Then open. And then we're going to finish with power chord, uh, a D power chord on root, the root 5, so that's going to be 5th uh, fret A string. I don't know, some people call it root 5 when it's on, you know, the roots on the A string. Whatever you call it, it's on a D, so it sounds like this slow. Okay, then we're going to go to the second time. Now this just has a different turnaround. So same front half. Now the turnaround this time is D A. It's just an old school D chord. Campfire D. Campfire A. Then to finish it, to turn us around, we go to the E string, fret three, fret two, zero. So played slowly, that sounds like this. The ending a little just to give it some variation so it's not just a repeat. So we have. Now instead of doing this, I start on that note, but I don't do the power chord. So I'm on the A string, fifth fret. I bend from that D up to the E. I go. And then I finish with this pentatonic lick that goes. Which is. 5th fret D string, then the E on the 7th fret A string, and then open E. So that whole part slow sounds like this. Now we're at the last part, the last time through. Again, same front half, and it's going to have the D A turnaround. towards the verse, which is in A, and so we do just a quick walk up from G. So played slowly, it sounds like this. Alright, so all together, slowly, the whole thing sounds like this. Thanks for tuning in. I hope that was helpful. I hope it was fun. Um, hopefully we'll get back out on the road when this is all over. We'll see you then.